We all know and we all agree that we consider metadata as data that describes and defines other data and creates a context. However, some uh, professionals may have different viewpoints. I even heard opinion that we shouldn't make a difference between data and metadata. And I'd like to share with you uh, one example. A couple of months ago, I spoke to a uh, chief architect and we discussed uh, different data management and governance topics. And he told me we don't need metadata management. So for me, the question what is metadata is the most important to start with. So I ju just now would like to pass um, the word to my colleague, Dr. C. Oh, thank you. Yes. I think, you know, um, for me, I, you so rightfully said this, Arena. I think one of the key things here is that there are differences between data and metadata. The word meta itself means something, right? So what is that underlying description um, and thought process? So it is, when we're talking about metadata, the impact, the business impact of that is going to be large. But I think main thing here is you already mentioned the context, the information. We see metadata surrounded um, everywhere, every single day. You look at a cereal box and you'll find you know, information about the content of what that serial is, right? So it gives you contextual information. It helps you in making an informed decision. So organizing, classifying, and stand standardizing that information is extremely important when it comes to business. And with that, I'm going to pass it on to Avila. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Sue. Well, let me put it in another uh well, we all know that uh, metadata is data about data, but I would like to think about it as pretty much the librarian of uh, our data world that we live in. Uh, how? Why is that? Well, without metadata, you would pretty much we would have a lot of unsorted books if we imagine a huge library, and if we need to retrieve a certain piece of information, we could spend the entire day searching for it and sometimes only to come up empty handed. So having the metadata, it's like having a skilled librarian who not only catalogs the information that we have, but knows exactly where each piece of information in each book is, when it was last accessed, what information it contains, etc., etc. So thanks to metadata, navigating of entire, a huge library becomes an easy task. So that's how I will put it. Yeah, I like to piggyback on that because I think, um, you know, discovery is certainly one very useful aspect of metadata, but I think we all know that we live in a world now where not everyone's data is in one format, not everyone's data is in one place or one vendor. And so uh, when data is so fractured uh, and, and not uniform, you need a single way to find and understand the data. And I think that's not having metadata would make it extremely difficult, but having good metadata makes that process um, much, much more streamlined, much more efficient, and also uh, enables that discovery to happen uh, across a lot more people, right? So people don't need to know the exact data asset name, the exact table name, the exact column name, for example. Um, having metadata actually makes it much, much easier to for people to search by context, by usage, et cetera. So that's where I see kind of the importance of metadata is. I Yeah, I've been working classifying data for over a decade now and never really thought of it as metadata. So I think there, there's different perceptions of it, I guess, from data versus non-data people. We're all working with it. But I think for the non-data people, it's probably quite intimidating. And and you can work without the, ta the term metadata and keep a uh, kind of standard consistency. But where something like metadata is probably like massively important is in like pharmaceuticals, when you've got medicine and you need like really strict metadata because, you know, someone's life could be at risk. So I think we can't also just, you know, blanket say yes or no to this. I think it really depends on the type of data that you're working with as well. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, so we just now share our viewpoints on metadata. Oh, look, I think... I, think uh, I would like maybe to add something about yeah. metadata. Okay, sure. Yeah, we'll agree on the fact that it helps discovery search uh, for data. But what I would like to add is that the metadata is moving very quickly with data mesh and data products and the type of metadata 
we are now in charge of documenting to not only discuss about data assets but data products where you have much more meaning around data, which is the infrastructure, the input port, the, the, court, the source codes, uh, the access request, the provisioning. So metadata tends to evolve very quickly in a much more fancy world where um, maintaining this will be a challenge.